Hello Internet, welcome to Doing Today's channel. We are going to discuss about web storage in this lesson. So web storage came with HTML5. Now you can store data in the client side. There's two ways of doing this. We can use local storage or session storage. Local storage and session storage are basically the same thing. The only difference is the local storage persists. So when the user closes the window and opens it back, the local storage data will be saved and you will be it will be available but the session storage will not so let's do a, a quick test on that uh, we will be using the set item get item remove item and key and clear functions with the local storage and session storage so let's get started uh, in my javascript file i'm going to do session storage dot set an item of course everything has to be a string so this is the key it has to be a string so key and do and this is the value okay when I do that then after that I'll do a console log session storage and get item so I have to pass in the key the key is key okay I'll refresh and we will get the value okay so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to comment this out save it refresh again we have the value so there you go we have the value but if i close this and come back again and take a look at our console we get null that is because it has been removed but if i change this to local storage local storage and change this to local storage as well and refresh we get the value but let's comment this out let's close this out and then again open our JavaScript then again check check our console we get still get the value so that is the difference between local storage and session storage during that process you learned how to set item and get item we stored and do session storage so session we can store objects as well but we have to stringify those in order to store them so let's create object literal id is 3 and uh, name is doing this job okay let's have that but we have to use json dot stringify to convert this to a string Okay, so let's change this to session storage, session, and let's get the item, and let's check this out. Yeah, it has been converted to a string, and we can see it. Now, of course, uh, to get the values of this object, we can use pass JSON. So JSON dot pass function, use that function, close the brackets, and refresh, we get the object. Of course, then we can use the properties ID to get the ID property, three or the name. Simple as that. Okay. Same goes with arrays. You have to convert. Uh, they will be converted to strings when you pass an array. So if they remove this and pass an array, let's say hello subscribers. And refresh so we have to remove this we have nothing to pass remove this and keep that okay and refresh as you can see it can gets converted to a string so it uses the two string function to do that behind the scenes okay that's it for that now let's remove this item so session storage you can use the remove item function we have to pass in the key and now we will get null because the get item key is not there refresh we get null and we can use the key function to get the key i mean we uh, let's do an example uh, so if i pass in key and zeroth element this will return key as the value because it will return the index zero so that is the value is key let's do another this key 
one and this is key zero let's refresh we get key zero if i if i want the first key i do this and i get key one okay finally we have the clear function what the clear function does it it removes everything so if i do clear here and this expects no parameters and if i do a console log of the session storage we get blank so if i remove this we get this storage we have the key hello subscribers key one hello subscribers okay so that is these are all these functions work exactly the same for session storage and local storage okay so that's it for this lesson i hope you understood what web storage is i will add some links to the description do read them through especially an article it explains very well uh, okay so thank you for watching do subscribe do hit the like and do share have a good day bye